All right, it's Friday, which means we spent a majority of the day cleaning out our inbox and looking for some questions that we have may, uh, may have missed this week. And we found a few. We'll start with this one from Linda, who asks, how concerned should we be about the Omicron subvariant given out relatively low vaccination rate and waning immunity? So it's called the Omicron subvariant, but is often referred to as the stealth variant because it has a genetic mutation that could make it more difficult to distinguish from the Delta variant. The World Health Organization says, as of yesterday, it is now the dominant variant in the United States. However, do not start panicking, please. While it does have a faster growth rate than Omicron, national health experts are not predicting another surge in cases. Okay, so what about here in Idaho? We reached out to the city of Boise's wastewater program to get a feel for what they're seeing right now. And Jake Merton with Public Works told us that there was BA2, which we just talked about, detected in our wastewater over the winter, but it was hardly anything traceable. That changed in the middle of March. During a testing of the wastewater on March 14th, which was the last time that it was tested, results showed about 32% of the COVID detected in the water was BA2. The other 68% was the original variant. And as we told you before on the 208, wastewater is usually the first indicator of what's to come. We reached out to the Department of Health and Welfare to see just how many cases of BA2 we've had in Idaho. Turns out, only 25 documented. To put that in perspective, yesterday, Idaho had just 72 new and probable cases. So while it may be the dominant variant in the United States, it is not yet in the state of Idaho.